Hi guys, thanks for joining me today. Today I'm going to do a very quick and easy wig tutorial for you. This is Easy Kenya that I'm wearing and it's as you can see it's very curly, very very full and you know that I like my curly full pieces whether it's my own natural curly hair or whether it is a, an addition to my hair. And um, this is a half wig and this is by the Janet Collection. And let me just show you the hang tag right here. This is Easy Kenya. And this color that I'm wearing is in a 1B. And it's very easy. And I have a collection of these Easy Wear wigs. They, they're all very similar, very curly, very full. And um, they look different because the cut is different, it's layered differently. But Kenya is really long. As you can see, her spirals are really long. And uh, it looks really nice on me. I have it on today. I have. I took a little bit of the hair from both sides and kind of twisted it over to cover the the line where the half wig starts. And I'll show you how to do that in this video. It's really easy. And I'm going to also show you that you can wear it with headbands since it's so hot here, especially in New York City and around the country. It's really, really hot. But if you want to wear a nice do, you don't always have to wear it full in your face the way I'm doing. You can wear it a little bit back wear it off your face with a headband and I'll show you a couple of headband options that I have and uh, to, I'll leave the link below so that you can go check Kenya out and see if you're interested in purchasing her also what I got in the mail was a card that tells a little bit about the savings that you can get for example for example Hair Stop and Shop has a price match guarantee and they say here on the card that we will match a competitor's price and add another 5% discount. So if you see Easy Kenya or any wig that Hair Stop and Shop sells at another site, at another wig site, and it costs a little bit less, all you have to do is copy and paste the link of the wig, send it back to hairstopandshop.com. If you're interested in purchasing that wig, they'll give it to you at the price that you saw it at, and they will give you another 5% discount. So that's really great and they also have free ground shipping and this is just for um, United States and PO box addresses guys and military bases only so now I'm going to just talk to you a little bit about Kenya what her specs are like the combs the inside I'm going to tell you a little bit about that okay guys here's the wig it's a very stretchy cap fit it'll fit any head really and the wig is very curly this color is a 1B, and a 1B is a very dark brown, and the hair is synthetic fibers. And that's the length. It's not very long, just full and curly. This is the inside of the wig cap, and it has a comb to secure the wig to your head. And the comb is very thin, it's not bulky, and it won't show any bulk when you wear it. And it also has a very thin comb in the back also and um, it has adjustable straps back there and as you can see it's by the Janet collection and inside this wig is just a standard wefted wig cap design it's open work so it can keep your head cool as you wear it and it's really very nice and it's very lightweight so I'm going to start by just showing you that I have on a wig cap. I wear a netted wig cap so that my hair and scalp can breathe under my wig and I wear a headband just to give myself a little bit more of a tighter fit because I find that a lot of these wigs are a little too loose on my head so I wear that headband. So I'm just going to slide it back a little bit and I'm going to insert that wig comb right there. I'm going to insert that right under my headband and it's very quick and easy to slide it right under the front end and just pull it over and slide the back comb under the underside of the headband and it's that quick and easy that wasn't even 10 seconds and all you have to do is just make sure it's in place and if you like you can hold it down with bobby pins I don't tend to use bobby pins I get a nice tight fit with the headband and the combs just holding everything in place and this is a very curly wig as you can see I love curly wigs and I like this style a lot and uh, I'm going to show you all and look at that head see the, the edge of the headband it lays really flat it, you, it's no bulk there 
at all. It's very, very flat. I'm going to show you a couple of headband options that you can uh, wear with this. This is the back, and the back is very lovely, as you can see. Nice and curly and full. So this is a braided headband that I picked up from the Beauty Supply Store for $1.99. And I just want to show you some headband options. And when you put your headbands on, make sure it's anchored just in front of the edge of the wig cap. Where that, you know, so that you don't show your the, the edge of the wig, the half wig. But it looks really nice with the headband. And this is another open worked headband. This is made out of satin around a plastic headband. It looks really cute. And uh, I like headbands a lot. Again, just make sure that your headband is covering that edge of the, the wig so that you can hide that. And I like that a lot. I'm going to show you a quick little twist design. You're going to take a piece of hair from the side, just where I'm pulling it from, twirl it and make it into a little twisty. And then secure it on the other end, just like I'm doing now. Just push it up under. And then do the same from the other side. And just twist it again. And then you're going to bring it over and just secure it again under the wig cap. Just the same way you did the first one. Just like this. And then if you want, you can hold that down with bobby pins. But this is a great style that you can wear. If you do it like this, you won't have to wear a headband. And then this is another option. And I like this option the best. This is what I tend to do because it looks a little more dressy and uh, and uh, tuck a little bit of the hair behind your ear if you like, if you like that look and uh, just play with the hair a little bit until you get it in a look that looks very complimentary to your face and that's it that was very quick, it's very easy, it doesn't even take 15 seconds to put the wig on and get it into place I like it a lot so I hope that you like this very quick tutorial. I hope that you like Kenya. I love it a lot. I think it's really pretty. I love curly do's. And um, thank you so much for joining me. I do appreciate it. So take care and be well. And I'll see you at the next video. Bye-bye.